guys, what's up? It's been a long while. Well, I haven't uh, made a video for so long facing the camera. <laughs> well, guys, uh, this is Jeff, also known as Crypto Nomad. So I'm, I'm here in my room, just finished my dinner. So um, it's been, you know, it's been a while that I haven't made a video about ICO reviews, you know, crowd sale and token sale uh, reviews out there. You know, because uh, I was uh, busy uh, distributing uh, the airdrop and uh, <clears throat> and helped uh, and help Metamorph to succeed. You know, by the way, I'm my position in Metamorph is a PR marketer and a bounty uh, manager. Okay, so so Yash is my uh, assistant. So. Uh, we are working things out okay to finalize it uh, to finalize those entries and for the airdrops yeah um pl uh, please have patience guys because uh, we are working now on on something that could speed things up okay to uh, distribute all right well anyway guys um the reason that i'm going to make this video is you know this is something very important you know this is uh quite something that could motivate you you know it could be applied in all life aspects you know okay so let's talk about how how are we going to deal with uh, the haters and the bashers you know if you are into or if you're into an ICO or if you are having some success in cryptocurrency or in any life aspect that you have right now okay so how are you going to deal with it you know um, but first let me share to you my story about about it you know so so last time, you know, um, it's been so it's been a few weeks. You know, I was emotional. You know, I, I was, you know, I was hurt. You know, because of because of someone who uh, doesn't like what I'm doing, who thinks that I'm doing I'm not doing the right thing. You know, they think that um, we are not going to succeed, and I was a part of this. You know, you know, it kind of hurt me. You know. Um, and I I totally understand you know because you have the right to criticize you know I welcome all of your criticizations you know when it comes to that so um, but you know you know I was you know to be honest I was heartbroken that time well wow it was it was uh, there was tough days for me you know it was emotional it was um, I don't have this focus. I don't have this focus right now on, on what should I be doing you know I was trying to find ways to to heal myself but but the thing is that it still it still remains in my mind and it hurts me a lot you know as what I've you know uh, as what I've shared to my friend you know it's better to be uh, physically hurt than emotionally hurt you know because you know um, it's okay if if this if it bleeds right here you know if I'm bleeding it can be um, you know you know it, uh, it, it can be stopped you know that easily but when it comes to emotional it's way harder because it's all about those feelings you know I know some of you guys you know uh, I know I know some of you um, um, are experiencing uh, like that you know um, I know you have haters I know you have bashers you know um, I don't know if you have succeeded in your life or you know or you are trying to or are you trying to do something to make you succeed but however those people are trying to stop you by hating you or bashing you you know uh, you know what I mean right okay so here's the thing you know um, Here's the thing about uh, hating or bashing. You know, it's real. It's really normal. It's, it's a. Uh, it's a. It, I treat this like um. You know, it's a difficult test. You know, like, like a, oh, I have passed this test, and then, as I go up, it's going to be difficult, because, because when I go up, the number of haters and bashers, are going to increase as well. So, it's either. It's either I'm going to uh, listen to them and go down and they will keep laughing at me or I could keep crawling up and prove them wrong. 
so you know what you know what and no matter how how many uh, how many of them are going to to hate me or to bash me you know uh, if you are one of them always watching this video it's a hater or a basher you know it's okay for me I respect you the thing is that you know no matter if you're going to hate me or you're going to bash me you can't stop me because you know um, from the day from the day that I decided myself that I am destined for a success there's no turning back there's no turning back for me now so I had to do it no matter how many obstacles that could stop me that could stand in my way I could still dig in I still have these tools to dig through it no matter how many times you're going to stop me you know so this is my message uh, if you are a hater or a basher you know and and also for those people you know also for others as well who have their own um, bashers and haters you know if they bash or hate you don't don't let them take over your emotions I repeat don't let them take over on what you are going through okay okay because they are not the ones guys they are not the ones who is going to uh, you know uh, who's going to decide for your life they're not the ones you're the one you're the one who will be deciding for your life even though you know I know that uh, I know that you are doing things right but if they are trying to stop you try to look at them take a good look at them are they succeeding or are they not you know even if the if the even if they succeed and they don't like what they're doing they keep uh, bashing you or hating you however if you believe it that you are going to succeed right through your heart for sure you will get there I repeat for sure you will get there in no time you know you know this is not just an ordinary a crypto video you know but this is something more motivation this is something that could motivate you could enlighten you okay so so here's the thing you know um, there is one there is one uh, article that I have read in the internet uh, lately that finally enlightened me uh, to uh, to keep doing what I'm doing you know because all of those uh, days you know I was so I was so emotional I was heartbroken no I, it's like it I, it's hard for me to move on you know but the thing is you know at the end of the day if, if you're if you can't move on then you're stuck you're stuck you're just stuck and remain and your life will remain the same you know think of it just think of it that those haters are there are just testing you you know even if they are hating you for real just put it in your mind that, that this is just a test you know this is just a test of strength to see how strong you are because no matter what because no matter how many times you know how hard are they going to bash you or hate you if you're destined for success for sure you you may uh, you may have uh, ignored them you know and focus on what you're doing you know so you know this article has um, has enlightened me you know it finally healed me a bit you know it finally healed me a bit so it's titled why most successful people have more haters so I have read the article it's quite interesting for me you know it for me you know um, it's a beautiful article you know from entrepreneur so um, because of that you know it's I finally you know I, f I finally realized everything you know I finally realized everything that you know uh, the more haters you have the more stronger you are the more you are destined for success no matter if you are into cryptocurrency no matter if you are in other field you know it can be applied it can be applied in all life aspects okay so 
you know, successful people like Donald Trump, you know, Donald Trump has more haters even until now and he is the president before he was president and he was one of the most successful entrepreneurs uh, who has have Trump Towers of course and has published many books I even have his book you know one of these books so um, no matter how many times he was hate or bashed you know it doesn't stop him why he was productive he was an action taker he does sent absorb all of those words you know that comes from the haters or the bashers he keeps continue working and those haters and bashers are you know sorry to say sorry to say about this that you know you're just wasting time you're just wasting time bashing or hating other people instead of being productive or just work on what you're doing you know to succeed you know in the cryptocurrency world yeah it's normal for us to have uh, this kind of competition you know, it's normal for us to have uh, you know these bashers out there that say oh we will be dumping this one because uh, because this one is uh, has no promise of that you know I totally understand that I totally understand that but you know um, you know that's what we call competition and you know you have to embrace it you have to embrace uh, the competition within you just have to stay cool for yourself even though if they bash you the hardest way you have to stay cool you have to keep calm just keep doing on what you are doing let your success make the noise okay I repeat let this success make your noise stop wasting your time bashing and hating other people you know if they bash you don't bash them back just keep doing what you're doing that is what I'm doing right now even though if it's hard for me even though the more people are going to bash to bash me or to hate me I just I just remain calm I just keep doing what I am going to do you know at the end of the day who will get the last laugh you know you know I'm you know you know I respect the I res I respect them you know uh, the bachelors and haters because I know uh, I know the fact that they are going they are also doing what it takes to succeed as well but that's not the that's like that's not an appropriate way you know yeah uh, for me you know about the competitors I have no problem with the competitors I even complimented them you know, I, I complimented them that hey you're doing a great job you know you're doing a great job your company is uh, you know it's impressive you know I wish you the best of luck okay so I didn't uh, you know I want to make it in a friendly way okay even though if they are bashing me you know bashing other friends you know I just, just keep it cool you know just keep it cool you just have to keep silent you know don't bash them or hate them back let them let them do it you just have to keep working okay so so that's the thing you know I have you know after I have read that article from entrepreneur um, all I could say is that I oh, finally thank God finally thank God I'm you know I was it made me it made me feel good you know and I could continue and I could continue to do what I'm going to do so it, it finally uh, you know I'm, I'm finally motivated again and I'm finally excited again so you know once again you just have to keep what you're doing and just ignore all of those hates you know all those bashes you know because uh, if you keep listening to them for sure you won't be productive and you will get lost you know you you might you know uh, you might not reach your goals so for me so me it, it is all about taking action you know if you believe on what you're doing if you believe in what you're doing just focus take action Ignore those haters, ignore those bashers. No matter how hard it is, just ignore them. 
Okay, so as you may all know, wow, this it is an incredible journey for me, you know, because um, you know, um, hating and you know, experiencing uh, bashing and hating from others, you know, it's it's a part of your success. It's a part of your journey to success. Okay, so so for me, I know there are people out there. Uh, I know some of you have experienced like this that oh they have unfriended me you know because you know they don't like what I'm doing because uh, they they hate me they bash me you know so they unfriend me and I know you guys uh, are having to f are feeling the same way as well because somebody has unfriended you because they don't they just don't acknowledge on what you are doing you know but it's okay but it's okay you know but it's okay, you know, even if they are friended, I respected them. I respected them, uh, you know, because, you know, at the end of the day, no, it's, you know, um, if you are do, if they, if, if they are going to do this to you, like hating or bashing, if, and you are going to do something like that, it could create a worse situation. It could create, okay? So, so, you know, all of those things, you know, you know what I'm you know what I did you know what I did um, I just instead of bashing or hating them I prayed for them you know I prayed uh, you know I prayed and then I, I you know I prayed to the Lord that um, that hopefully there is a good sign of them and may the Lord touch their hearts may the Lord bless them more you know Lord and I, I also said I also pray to the Lord that Lord forgive them. Lord forgive them for for bashing me and hating me. Lord forgive them, because I know we are all not perfect. Yeah, because we are all we are not perfect. Only God is perfect. So, you know that's what I do. That's what I do. So instead, so instead of bashing them back, instead of hating them back, I prayed for them. I know, I know, if you are a hater right now, if you're a basher of me right now, I prayed for you. I prayed for your, I prayed for your success. I prayed that the Lord will touch your heart, will bless you more. Because I know you have your own goals. Okay? So, you know, you could keep bashing me after this video or hating me after this video. But I will still pray for you. Mark my words. I will pray for you. Because you know why. I'm a Christian. I'm a Christian because, you know, I already know deeply about Jesus. So, for me, so for me, it's not a good way for me to bash or hate you back. You know, no matter what you do, I forgive you. I forgive them what you are doing. Even if you keep doing the same thing, I forgive you. That's the thing. You know, in the Bible says that, you know, God will not only forgive you seven times, but infinite forgiveness. We're just people, you know. We're just people. So, if you're watching this and if you hate me, if you bash me, again, I forgive you. Even if it hurts me, I forgive you 100%. So, you know, I don't have problems that we could be friends again or something like that in the future, you know, or it's okay. I understand. Even if you don't want to make friends with me, it's okay. I would still pray for you, okay? You know, I hope, uh, I know this video is, uh, you know, something that is off topic, but, you know, I hope this, I hope this is something that could touch your heart you know because you know what I feel right now I know you have felt it before or you have felt it right now because you have your own bashers and haters out there you know, but take note of this if you want to become successful if you want to become successful let your success make the noise just take action okay just let them come in just let 
these haters and bashers come right, right at you, okay? Make them laugh at you. You know, I was being laugh as well. But it's okay. I forgive them. I forgive them 100%. Because, because you know, when I said, when I said that, you know, when I said this, that, Lord, I surrender to you all of the pain that I have, the sufferings I have, I surrender this all to you. Lord, I will forgive them no matter what. It, you know, finally, it, you know, um, it, you know, just day by day, this pain that I have, the pain that I have right here emotionally, starts to, you know, starts to fade away. Because I declared right now that no matter what, I forgive you. Okay? Okay, you know, if, if we meet, yeah, and if and if one day we will meet, yeah, I forgive you 100% for bashing me and for hating me. And I know you felt the same way as well. Okay? No matter if you are into cryptocurrency, no matter if you are into any field, just like, just like you're in the health industry, in the real estate industry, or even in your office work. Guys, learn how to forgive. That is the only way. That is the only way to heal yourself. Okay? So, I hope you guys have learned something about uh, my video. This video right now. Okay? You know, because I, I know you guys understand what I'm going through these past few days. But it's okay for me. Because I know you felt the same way as well. If there are somebody out there who is trying to break your heart okay I know it will take time to heal, to heal but if you learn how to forgive if you learn how to surrender all of your pain and suffering for sure everything that you're feeling bad right now it will fade away because you have surrendered all of it to the Lord okay well, guys, um, this is all for now. I hope this motivates you right now. No matter what field do you have, do you are, are, I mean, are you in right now? Okay. So, um, thank you very much for uh, taking your time to watch this video. Okay. So, um, if you feel that uh, this video has motivated you a bit, or if there's something that touches your heart, you know. Or something that is really inspiring guys just don't hesitate to share this to your friends okay to share this video to your friends all right and make sure guys that you subscribe to my youtube channel okay so that you can stay updated with my latest videos about cryptocurrency ICO reviews airdrops and bounties and of course some little motivations as well okay all right so I want uh, so uh, this is all for now <laughs> all right uh, my name is Jeff, also known as Crypto Nomad, and I'm signing off. God bless.